Hey, I'm Jen Ader, fitness editor at Women's Health. The kettlebell is a great workout tool because you can use it to sculpt your entire body. With this workout, we've made it even more time effective by combining exercises so that you're working your upper, lower body, your core for the entire workout. This is the swing with leg raise. For this move, you want to focus on keeping your core tight and really keeping your balance throughout. So keeping that core tight is going to really help you as you're lifting your legs with each rep. To start this exercise, grab the kettlebell with both hands. You want your palms facing your body and stand with your feet about hip width apart. Make sure that your chest is up, your shoulders are back. Bend your knees and sit your hips back. And then in one motion, press through your heels as you swing the kettlebell overhead raising your left leg off the ground. You really want to focus on squeezing your glute as you raise your leg. That's going to make sure that you're really activating that outer thigh area. As you lower it, you can kind of let it swing back behind you and use that momentum to bring it back up with each rep. For this move, think slow and controlled. You want a nice even pace as you work through these reps. You don't want to be swinging the kettlebell up towards your shoulder. You really want it to be nice and slow so that you're really engaging your biceps with each rep. Start this move by grabbing a kettlebell and holding it in your left hand and stand with your feet close together. Then step out to the right, curl the kettlebell up towards your right shoulder, slowly lower it, and press through your right heel to return to start. You want to slowly raise and lower it to make sure that you're fully activating your biceps and not just using the momentum of the bell to complete each rep. You'll complete all the reps on that side, then switch arms and legs and repeat. This is the ultimate total body move. Think of it as one fluid motion starting in your heels and ending through the palms of your hands as you press the weight overhead. Grab the bottom of the kettlebell with both hands and hold it in front of your chest, elbows bent. Keeping your chest upright, bend your knees and sit your hips back to lower into a squat. Then in one motion, press through your heels to press the weight over your right shoulder. Repeat that on the other side. Each time you do this, you really want to focus on having it be one motion from your heels to your palms. You'll continue alternating back and forth until you complete all your reps. The key for this exercise is keeping your chest upright, not leaning forward, as you pass the kettlebell under your leg with each lunge. Start with the bell in your left hand. Lunge forward with your right leg and pass the bell under your leg into your right hand. Step back to standing, then row the weight up to chest level. Repeat on the other side and continue alternating. Keep your back flat as you row the weight up to your chest. <music> 